for being such an incredible part of my NFL childhood and my formative years at the University of Washington down the street. Uh, oh, well, yeah, now the question I have for you is about the run game. Uh, in the event that the Seahawks get priced out of Chris Carson, could Rashad Penny be the guy? He could, yeah. I mean, yeah, obviously, uh, the one thing that's interesting about this hire is that uh, you know, it goes into the, the Kyle Shanahan, Mike Shanahan system, you know, which, of course, that's what Sean McVay has. And, you know, you can get so much more out of back, even with the rotation. Because, I mean, look at the success of the 49ers have had running the football. And week to week, you don't know which guy it's going to be. I mean, that goes back to Mike Shanahan. So we're taking a guy like Terrell Davis, who is a fullback, six-round pick. Absolutely. And him become a Hall of Fame running back. And so uh, it's, a, it's a system that can get the most out of back. And so what you need is you know, a, a, enough. And, of course, you know, I think there's one guy they couldn't bring back if they lose uh, you know, if they lose Carson would be uh, Mike Davis. And the other thing is if you look around at the class of 2017, there's a lot of backs. Because a lot of backs in that class, I think there's like about 10 who were up for free agency. A couple of them ended up getting deals. I mean, Joe Mixon got a deal. McCaffrey. McCaffrey, yeah. And so uh, there's a lot of those backs. And a lot may not be able to be affordable for teams because, again, the market's going to be down for the prices. So if they can't get Chris Carson back, there will be options. The question is going to be what the price is going to be. And w- quick follow-up to that, um, you know, Rashad obviously having injury issues his, his first three years. Do you remember a back that may have struggled his first three years but then transitioned to the guy? I mean, I mean you could say Derek Henry struggled his first couple of years. And sure. Love it, John. Well, I can't thank you enough, Professor, for the time. Okay, Matthew, thank you. 866-979-ESPN, 206-421-ESPN. Sounds like that.